na mimi nataka niwaulize wale wafanyikazi wote wa serikali wanahusika na mambo ya chanjo mambo ya chanjo ni mambo ya muhimu sana katika taifa letu la Kenya na tusiingize mambo duni ya siasa ndani ya chanjo watu wa Kenya wanakufa watu wa Kenya wanapoteza maisha yao uchumi ya Kenya iko na matatizo kwa sababu watu hawafanyi kazi hawafanyi biashara tunataka mambo ya program ya chanjo ifanyike haraka na iwe na mpango na taratibu ya sawasawa tuwachanje wa Kenya ndio tuweze kupata nafasi ya kurudi kwa shughuli zetu wale wa kufanya kazi wafanye kazi wa kufanya biashara wafanye biashara tuweze kupeleka taifa letu mbele tuwache kuuzisha mambo ya chanjo na mambo ya uchaguzi they are separate and we want to make sure that every citizen in Kenya because it is their right pesa tumeweka bilioni karibu 30 ya kununua chanjo bunge tayari imepo, imepitisha sasa hatuna nafasi ya kupoteza tunataka chanjo ziletwe wananchi wapangwe kila mtu achanjwe ndio tuweze kuokoa wananchi wengi wanaopoteza maisha yao na tuweze pia kuokoa wale wanaangaika kwa mambo ya uchumi waweze kurudi kazini waweze kurudi katika biashara zao ndio tuweze kupeleka Kenya yetu mbele tunaelewana jameni na mimi nawauliza wa Kenya wote wajitokeze mahali kuna chanjo wa Kenya wajitokeze kila mtu apate chanjo mtu asiwadanganye ati mtu akichanjwa kutakuwa na makosa hii watu wote wamechanjwa rais amechanjwa mimi nimechanjwa wengine mawaziri kila mtu so na hiyo chanjo iko sawa sawa tunataka twende pamoja tunaelewana jameni niliwaambia na iko in public domain you know kuna watu wanajaribu kusema nilifanya makosa kwa kutounga mkono mambo ya BBI lakini niko na jukumu ya kuambia rais na kuambia taifa maoni yangu na ukweli ninaojua niliwaambia kule bomas hii BBI iko na shida yale mambo yako ndani ya hapa BBI haipeleki Kenya mbele inarudisha Kenya nyuma na yale yote niliwaambia ndio mahakama imewaambia na ndio hiyo BBI imekwama sasa mimi najiuliza kwani nilifanya makosa kusema ukweli kwani nilifanya ilikuwa ni makosa kusema BBI iko na makosa hii BBI iko na makosa hii na hiyo mambo yote mimi nilisema kuna makosa kwa BBI imedhibitishwa na mahakama ndio BBI imesimama so kama wangenisikiliza siku ile hatungekuwa hapa situngerekebisha hii kitu na tungeiondoa ile makosa iko ndani yake lakini sasa kwa vijindo na nguvu na kifua walisukuma BBI sasa saa hii imeanguka wanajaribu kunlaumu mimi sasa mnalaumu namna gani na niliwaambia mapema iko matatizo na hii kitu ile niliwaambia si ndio hii wameambiwa na, maka, na mahakama mimi niko na makosa jameni kwani kusema ukweli kwa Kenya kuna makosa kwani kusema ukweli wakati umeona kuna maneno kwa makosa iko, iko makosa sasa mbona watu wananitia makosa ati mimi niko na makosa kwa sababu sikuunga mkono mambo ya BBI but you know there, there is a problem you know i raised the very issues i raised as a citizen and try to advise those of us who are leaders about the faults and the problems and the challenges of BBI how can anybody hold it against me today that i did not support BBI when i clearly stated my position on matters that are controversial and matters that are unconstitutional today my position has been vindicated by the court that BBI had serious constitutional challenges and that is why it has stopped <laughs>